What's going on, Geek Fam? Geekspot82. I just picked up this great box of Ikoria. It's May 15th, 2020. Let's do a box opening and see what we get. What do you guys say? All right, guys. Let's see what we can get in this box of Ikoria. Is there anything you guys were interested in or excited about from this set? I know for myself, I'm really excited about all the dinosaurs. Uh, one of my favorite decks to run is my dino deck. And this is really going to either A, beef it up, or B, give me something to build a new dino deck with. And we can see what we can get. So, we just opened the box. And I got a box topper. That's exciting. We're going to save that one till the end now. We're gonna hop right in and start opening some packs. So the first pack here uh, has Vivian and her beastie. Human soldier token. All right, so these are backwards and the rare is toward the front. That's gonna be fun. Haunted Nightmare, four or five with Menace. Actually really excited to get a General's Enforcer Legendary Humans deck. It's gonna come along very nicely. We won't spend too much time on the commons. A shark token. Who else is going to build a Sharknado deck? Come on, I can't be the only one. A Plains, and our first legendary Dinosaur Hippo. Karuga, the Macro Sage. Another Dinosaur. Looks like the Eye of Sauron watching me now. I was lucky enough that my store was open and I was able to pick this up on the date of release. Uh, big shout out to Millennium Games. Thanks for hooking me up. And uh, here's our dinosaur token. Second legendary creature. Kahira, the Orphan Guard, a legendary cat beast. Momentum Rumbler Dinosaur. A Nightmare Squirrel. Bird. We'll peek it. That's pretty hip. Alright. Like King Kong. Package here. And we get a feather. Legendary Jengatha, the Wellspring, Elemental Elk. Shark Beast. I'm going into this set. I, I viewed some of the spoilers because it's hard to get around them. And Prickly Marmoset, uh, Creature Monkey. Uh, but I'm, bit, I'm going in this set fairly blind. I looked at some of the spoilers. I didn't go overboard. I wanted to get surprised. Um, let's see what we can get. And I didn't know when it was going to come out, so I didn't want to sit there waiting on it. You know, just dying to get it in hand. So, Ruinous Ultimatum. That's going to go well in my nights. Excited for that one. Dusk Bane Mentor, a human cleric. Ooh, another kitty cat. Another alternate art. In 
Unstable Hemophage. Creature Nightmare. I like the comic style art on some of these. I like the new art for Evolving Winds as well. Kitty cat. Human scout. Oh, man. <clears throat> Most of you had your orders for the uh, Commander Precons delayed, which is unfortunate, but I'm really looking forward to getting those in hand as well. A different human soldier token. That's fun. Mythos of Badrock. That's a Seb McKinnon art piece if I've ever seen one. Chittering Harvester Nightmare. Dire Tactics. This is going to go really great in my Orzhov deck. Uh, remember for that one I'm only using the gold bordered Orzhov cards. counters. So these you're just going to punch out. There you go. Death Touch. Life Link. I'm not going to do them all. But, uh, so you get your plus one, plus one. Reach, Hexproof, Menace, First Strike. Flip them over. Flying, Trample. Different Flying. Plus one, plus one, and Vigilance. So those are going to be really helpful. I, I like that we're going to be able to put counters on creatures that are going to be a lot harder to get rid of than maybe an, an artifact or something like that. So that's going to be fun. Kogla, the Titan Ape. Legendary Creature Ape. That's that King Kong looking creature that was on some of the packs. That's really hip. Raptor. Just a, a 4 2 little dino. I think that is another human soldier token that is completely different. Obosh, the Prey Piercer. I think that's the creature that was in the trailer for the new set. Dinosaur cat. That nightmare squirrel. And the prickly marmoset. Those might be two of my favorite cards in the whole set, to be honest. Tricycle land. I'm really excited to have that in the full art. That's gorgeous. Another tricycle land. Fairy Dragon, that was one I was excited for. Both because I have a fairy deck and a dragon deck. Which one will it go with? Dino 
password with haste token. Human soldier. Necropanther. That'd be good for the Orzhov deck. Maybe not see. Sleeper dart. I like that little beast looking guy. Excited for this cycle of uh, artifacts as well. The egg. I don't know if you saw Mark Rosewater talking about Magic the Gathering and its eggs, but this was what he was referring to. The thieving otter. That's cute. I like that uh, they've included the full art cards in your normal packs as well. Uh, you don't just have to buy the collector's booster box to get them. It uh, definitely helps with not feeling as bad about it, so uh, that's nice. Another one of the tricycle lands. A regal Leosaur. I'm excited for that. That's nice. So my other dinosaur deck is all about the Enrage trigger. I think it might be nice to do a mutating dinosaur deck in this one. Based solely off this set, you know, you could make a brawl deck or, you know, if you do it correctly, you could do a full-on commander deck. And uh, that'd be fun, I think. I don't know that they... how well they'll synergize with the other dinosaurs we've been given previously. This 
definitely gonna have to go in my five color ponies deck. That's pretty cool. Back four. Oh, another cavern with her. Spider for the spider deck. What is a bushwog? The almighty bushwog. That's hilarious. Legendary ooze. Amori the collector. Just great shark. I'm telling you guys, Sharknado is coming. Leviathan, that's gonna be good. I have a Leviathan deck now. Phoenixes. I have every Phoenix in Magic the Gathering. I usually try to make sure I have them in foil. This one's not, but that's okay. But it's nice to have them. collecting magic. Is there anything specifically? Is there a certain creature type or uh, you know, I also collect planeswalkers. I have every planeswalker printed in the game. Uh, currently also working on every legendary creature. Not every printing of every legendary creature, but at least one of every legendary creature. Genesis Ultimatum, that's nice. Um, what do you guys collect? No. If I collect, I mean, like, I, I don't even put these in those things in decks. Those are just things I keep for myself uh, in binders more than anything else. Okay. Another full art, migratory great horn. Speaking of planeswalkers, there's one of the two from the core set of the Lycoria. Vivian. The Wolf Bear. I think this is going to be a fun set to play, guys. Unfortunately, in quarantine, we didn't really get to have the uh, pre release. But I still think a little Moss Rough, Luminous Brood Moth. Disappointed we didn't get to have the pre release, but I'm still very excited to get my hands on these cards and start building around them and kind of see what we can do with them, huh? It'll be interesting to see what the standard environment's going to look like this season. A little foil device. Crystalline. 
giant. Necropanther. I think that's the third Necropanther. My brush wag again. Sky Nomad, Legendary Bird Serpent, Valiant Rescuer, this looks like the uh, Galgori Hunter from the last set, carrying the deer, I don't know if you guys remember that one. A lot of soldiers.